Hi everyone. Got my mask. Got my mask on my chin. Um really I'm just I'm waiting for Target to open. It's 7.40. Target opens at 8. And this morning I was have my own cats to take care of. So I get up at six. Um and I'll leave that one in for you. For you. Anyway, so basically I just got out of bed. This is what, what my hair looks like when I go to bed. And yeah, I got iced coffee from Starbucks. Oh, gotten people showing up now. So we're getting close to time. Fuck if I am ever going to make paella in my entire life. I don't think, could be wrong, I don't like paella, <laughs> so that probably has something to do with it. I mean, I don't dislike it, I guess, if somebody was like, here's a pile of dog shit or some paella, I would eat the paella. If somebody was like, here's a turkey sandwich and some paella, I would eat the turkey sandwich. That's about how I am with paella. And I don't really know. I think I had a bad experience with paella growing up. I think the experience was we went to a neighbor's house after we moved to Virginia. Went to a neighbor's house. Because you're supposed to do shit like that, I guess. And they had us over for dinner. And there were some... There were some... Interesting people. And... Similar to that episode in The Office where, like, Jim and Pam... And is it Andy and it's Andy and anyway, why am I talking about the office? But they're, you know, at Michael Scott's house and everyone is like waiting for dinner and she's making like osobuco, isn't that? That's another dish that's like, I'll eat it. I'll, like I'll eat osobuco faster than I'll eat a paella. I'll eat a paella. <laughs> Um, I think my mom makes osobuco. I don't know. I don't really like it either. It's just weird with the bone and then you like... It, that's not... These are... We've just discussed two dishes that I would really rather not. Um, anyway. But it took forever. I was so hungry. And, you know, when you're a kid in that situation, they didn't have kids, you know. And of course, my parents, they like... I don't know if we're like social buffers or something, but it's like, why the fuck am I going to a dinner party with the neighbors? I'm in high school. I guess I am. So I'm gonna sit around, not be able to drink, which I now, you know, know. It's like, oh, this is how people do these things. They're just getting, slowly getting shit faced. That makes a complete sense everything makes way more sense now you know oh somebody just pulled up oh they're pulling away oh you're pulling closer oh you're doing that move that's the thing is like i, I pulled pretty close because there's no cars but i normally like i'm parking like my ass back over there i don't care i don't want to get into that like hubbub of bullshit okay more people are showing up it's about it's we're five minutes oh my goodness oh my goodness look at these women these are all just like the same kind of ass women i hope i'm not included in this i don't think i am but i'm gonna wait i don't want to be the first one to go into target that's pretty embarrassing you know like, oh my god, I'm so tired. Um, that lady works at Target. I've I've been seeing people going, oh, oh, here she go, here she go, parked in a handicapped spot. My sister is handicapped. 
So, better not be misusing that, lady. I'll call the cops. $500 fine. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now you're fucking standing there. I don't know why I hate this lady. <laughs> I guess, you know, through the years, you know, <clears throat> now that I am a professional business analyst, that's not, jeez, Louise, look at all these people. Oh, they're behind me. Oh my goodness. Oh, straight in front of me. Oh my God. I wish I could turn the camera around. It's a dude. He has like gauged ears. He's driving like this crazy Nissan car. Maybe I'll put it like there so you can see like the kind of car. Oh, he's smoking a cigarette. He has um, cheetah print tattoos. on his arms and it looks like I can't quite tell I'm not gonna stare but he is like straight in front of me um he has like some kind of a mohawk situation and he has lots and lots of stuff on his rear view mirror I don't think I don't have anything hanging from my rear view mirror because it was um you know it was told to me at a young age that that was holy shit <laughs> that that was uh dangerous Oh my goodness. He's got his own fucking... Wow. Yeah, he's got a mohawk. He's got a vest on that he's made with his patches. He's got studs. Real skinny black jeans on. We're just in another world. And he about to stand outside with Miss Thing? Well, I don't want to be the first one to go into Target. I, I'm not going to claim I was the first one here. I very well could have not been the first one here. But I feel like I was, like, one of the first ones here. So. But, you know, it's not really, like, what the fuck are we all doing here? There's no shortages. There's no... It's really, like, I just don't want to be a Target at the fucking height of the bullshit on a Sunday and I don't know if this is gonna be like I haven't I don't think I've been to Target oh they're opening the door so I'm gonna get going but um thanks for listening I'm gonna make you know you'll see more video so. pretty much got that one done Oh, yeah, my wallet's behind my phone. <laughs> Bye.